Hi, hello and welcome to another episode of Bad Fed Movie. Uh, today I'm coming at you from the Xi'an International Airport. As you can see back there, it does the flight information. And it's almost 10 o'clock in the evening and you might be wondering <laughs> why I'm walking around the uh, uh, airport wearing flip-flops and in my pajamas. The reason is because I'm staying at what is called a space hotel. These are like space cabin hotels uh, that are, well, pretty popular in Japan uh, a few decades ago, but now they're making a boom here in China. They're extremely convenient, cheap, clean, safe, and um, well, you don't have to get out of the airport if you have a flight that's early in the morning. Then you can um, just make a quick exit dash to the check-in counter and that's it. So let's have a look. Now, so everybody's already sleeping, so it's pretty quiet. It's a bit dark in here. Let's go into my room. There's somebody sleeping on top of me. This is my room. So the way it works is you get your card, you place it here, and that opens the door. It's unlocked now, and you manually open it. Now inside, you insert your card in there and it activates the power. And uh, let me turn this around. Okay, I'm very, very dark in here. So basically, this is what it looks like. Uh, you leave your flip flops. You leave your flip flops outside. Let me take out my phone, which was here. And now let me show you a little bit what the room looks like. Um, when you bring your suitcases, right, you you can put them in a locker. So my suitcase and my big backpack is in a locker right now. It's free. And uh, what I have here is like my carry-on kind of stuff, my laptop, my iPad, my camera, my passport, like some of those things that I don't want to um, leave um, away from me when I travel. And uh, well, there's a few controls here. There's an alarm, a uh, fire alarm indicator here, smoke alarm. There's um, a fire extinguisher here. Um, what else do you have? Okay, this is for my coffee tomorrow. Uh, my passport. This is the ceiling lights, so you can control the intensity of the lights in the ceiling. Um, also the fan. Yeah, this is the maximum. There are fans over there over there and over here basically three fans to recycle and move the air out um, you get one USB port to charge but I have this double one so I can charge two things at once um, this is when you close the door you press this button the unlock and it will open the door press this button for keep quiet this one for not there's no smoking. TV, this is basically the cheaper one, the cheaper room, uh, which is three square meters. Um, it's like 1.2 by 2.5, I don't know. Uh, plenty of room for a very tall person. I'm very short, so it doesn't matter. And, um, but the, the bigger one, which is like five square meters, it has a TV. Um, what else? There's the uh, reading lights here, so you can adjust reading lights over there yeah there's the maximum there's the minimum but that's off that's on um, there is kind of like an intercom over there that you can use if, if you have like an emergency or anything that you need um there's a very small safe here uh, it works like pretty much any safe in any hotel you just have a password and that's it and um Okay, so you get your pillow, you get your quilt. Um, what else is cool? Okay, so when you close this, 
give you one extra security. Just a chain. And you can lock it up. Um, there's also a bathroom. Um, so it's a hot shower. So you can actually um, have a shower either before you go to bed or in the morning. You know, Chinese people take showers in the morning. Sorry, in the evening. I take shower in the morning. So uh, my flight tomorrow is at 8 o'clock. So I will be um, waking up a bit earlier. Should be checking in at 6. So I'll get up around 5. Finish packing my things, uh, take a shower, and then go to, to take my flight. So yeah, this is a very, very short video just to show you this cool new thing that is taking place here in China. Um, first time I saw this uh, was in Xinjiang when I was there with Noel. And, um, but that day we, we, we saw it and, and I think I took a picture with him, of him in the, in the pod. But I've never actually stayed in one. So this time around I decided to, yeah, to give it a go since they're here in Xi'an. Um, so, okay, that's it guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. And as always, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you like the content that I'm putting together, make sure to subscribe to my channel. And if you do that, don't forget to hit the bell button to be notified whenever there's a new video out. And until I see you again, take it easy and bye for now.